Belgaum is a, I can say entrance of Karnataka from the side of Maharashtra and when I was there it was covid going on people were still scared and I was really unknown like what to do where to go and xyz kind of thing I was just roaming here there searching for a small temple and I must have passed through one of the media houses and when I was passing some people from media just saw my bicycle they stopped me they got into the conversation and i don't know what they feel they released one news about me that one person doing excited kind of things on the bicycle and i then moved forward i was totally shocked actually it is said you know that when you decide something from the very 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 bottom of your heart this entire universe help you to meet that particular thing or with your goal with your dream some same thing must have happened once that news got released i started receiving many calls from the various part of karnataka even the city where i was i found one person he called me he said like sir uh, you are in belgaum you can come to my home you can stay with uh, stay with us with my family again i found the people uh, on the call only that person was from the bangalore he was uh, in my touch since like uh, since the that news got uh, published he said like whenever you come here in bangalore don't worry you are, you feel like your own home is here and you can stay with us and this kind of calls i started receiving and i kept continuing my journey i went to goa and when i went to goa i was shocked like from the collectorate office i got an invitation to stay in the guest house i left to goa and i was on the coastal road up to bangalore and while going to bangalore one magic happened i met one person shilar madhavan who is a founder of group all india cycling helpline family of kerala so when i met him i was just riding my bicycle he came from behind with his bike he stopped me and we had a tea and when we were having tea he <coughs> we had <coughs> conversation about each other and then he said we shall no matter where you go there ever you go in kerala you just let me know i have people in each and every district my group is spread all over kerala <coughs> sorry i think due to the cold my throat is little fluctuating but it's okay <coughs> then, <coughs> sorry then again i went to uh, bangalore may from bangalore to bangalore then mysore then utti and then kasar gold which is actually the entrance of kerala then when i had reached uh, kasar gold i met haider bhai then another uh, founder of the same group he posted one small video about my journey on that group and the moment he posted my video on that group i started receiving almost hundreds of the call in a day people from the kerala the bike riders from the kerala were, <coughs> were calling me inviting me to their home from each and every district of kerala and i decided i will go through each and every district of kerala then the journey was continuing but again you know whenever the worst happen to you it's actually not the worst there is a best with us just we need to give some time to the time when i reached trivandrum it was a peak second wave of covid and i was supposed to survive so what to do now now i need to survive so i thought it's good like to search for a small work and ask them for food and accommodation not for the salary so i <coughs> sorry in, in one of the resort i found a job as a waiter uh, because that resort was kind of quarantine center for merchant navy sailors so i decided okay at least i am getting food and accommodation hotel side it i will work as a waiter so i worked as a waiter for 2 months in that resort and in that period i encountered one very interesting person captain sachin dalvi and when he came to know about the journey we had mutual sharings with each other and all he said vishal after this after kerala wherever you are going in tamil nadu you let me know i connect you with my another uh, partner of my business <coughs> he will he will be there to assist you all across tamil nadu so via sachin the uh, uh, captain sachin dalvi i got captain jaivind another jain sub person he is from nagar coil nearby uh, kanyakumari he was constantly on my call giving me the references to different cities up to chennai he was there assisting me for 
for uh, like hosting me somewhere and many things i i don't have i actually failed to express my gratitude for these gents of people in the same course cycling community also came to know uh, like in whenever i used to go to the different cities there used to be the cycling groups and they also used to come to know like someone has come and all so they used to also take interest in hosting me because world traveler obviously as i am a traveler so i am having a special or exceptional kind of compassion for another traveler so they all me they all are also having the same so they also started referring me to other groups and whenever i used to go to the other group they used to be ready to welcome me and host me and xyz kind of things in this way i reached hyderabad there also i found one person who actually who assisted me all across uh, andhra pradesh and telangana then <coughs> as i was continuing i came to, uh, i reached uh, visakhapatnam there i met one vaishali ma'am uh, she is actually uh, a bike rider so she was also from the maharashtra she gave me reference in bhubneshwar there i met uh, amita ma'am who uh, assisted me all across odisha and that uh, ma'am gave me reference of datta da animesh datta another gems of person from kolkata so when i reached kolkata that animesh datta dada he assisted me he uh, like referred me uh, actually he is also a bike rider so he got me into his community and he as uh, uh, gave me references all across not only in <coughs> west bengal but in nepal also in bihar also and now i am in north east so here also he is like a backbone he is always on the call he keeps on calling me vishal ka hai tu where you are so if you are going to this city my friend is there shall i call him or not <laughs> especially when i went to nepal i got diamond uh, animesh datta da had given me his reference diamond sarkar one of founder of pore group nepal and diamond is a guy who assisted me all across nepal so in this way i don't know what is happening but i must say some people in your life no are given to you like a gift they are actually the gift from the universe they come to your life to nourish you not close you and not only those people but who say were is watching this video one day i'm coming to your city also i don't know where you are and all but i am thankful to you also and all the people that i have been meeting up to today for such a wonderful memories such a wonderful i don't know what to say because the thing which is actually very pure from your heart no you cannot express it into the words for example i am staying with this beautiful family here in siu sagar since five days i was sick but they are taking care of me like their own child i met this girl when i was in kohima attending hornbill they invited me like whenever you are crossing our city you are most welcome to our home and i am here <laughs> so thank you so much everyone hope you like this another part of the video too